to support the efforts of the government to halt the spread of infectious diseases such as diarrhea, cholera, and coronavirus. Water Aid Nigeria and South Saharan Social Development Organization are implementing a hygiene behavior change coalition, HBCC2 project, funded by the Foreign Commonwealth and Development Office, FCDO, and Unilever. Recognizing the critical role of schools, water aid, and hub partners through this project, trained 180 teachers, students, and school-based management committees from 30 schools in Iweze, North Local Government Area, on hygiene behavioral change, HBC, to promote sanitation and good hygiene practices in schools and the communities at large. I participated in the workshop that was organized by Water Aid Nigeria. We were now enlightened to come to our various schools to establish this uh, environmental health club. And we established the club in 1st February 2023. And it was inaugurated by the head teacher of the school. The basic thing there is ensuring and promoting cleanliness in the school, in the life of the pupils, and also in the community at large. And we have been demonstrating that during the assembly, we enlightened the pupils on how to, on personal cleanliness, how to wash appropriately. How not just to wash, but how to wash appropriately and the times necessary for that washing. At the end of the six-day workshop, the respective schools developed unique action plans that showed the various activities and timelines that would eventually lead to establishing the Environmental Health Clubs, EHCs, in these schools. Since the establishment of these EHCs, these clubs have done tremendously well in sensitizing pupils and the community members on proper hand-washing techniques at critical times times, personal hygiene, proper waste management, and advocating for gender-inclusive toilets. I am the president of the Environmental Health Club in my school, Township School 1, Ubte. I am the vice president in the Environmental Health Club in Township School 1, Ubte. My duty as a president is to assure that the school environment is clean and the people maintain good personal hygiene. Before now, the children are scattering waste all over the school. But now we have dig a hole where we put all the waste. My duty is to keep the compact neat, to make sure every Friday all the children come out to keep the environment clean. We also teach pupils personal hygiene, like how to wash our hands and when to wash our hands. For example, after going to the toilet, after visiting the hospital, after touching animals, before and after eating, and so on. I'm one of the facilitators that uh, went to the, the, the wash uh, workshop at Ogrute. But later we decided on our own the idea that we land there down to our school. We established what we land there that is called the EHC which means Environmental Health Club. But since we established uh, the Environmental Health Club in our school, wow, there are many changes. Even the ideas have been disseminated to the villagers at home. 
because of what our children are learning here and what they have learned since they were established in the EHC. So since that day, we have been doing it. Initially, we call the teachers, we introduce, we explain what we learned from the workshop to them. They all welcome the development. After that, we call the the SBMC chairman and the, the rest of others, all of them came. We introduced the washing hands to both junior class and the senior classes. And since then, even we bought more buckets, more buckets that are with the running tap. So after break, all the children we gather in line, we, they, we kill them and they wash their hands class by class before they, before they, they go to their classes. So that's what, that's what we are doing. And even we are, we are telling our children, we are, we are educating them to educate their parents as well, for them to be, to, to be uh, imbibed by the, by the rules of keeping their environments very clean so that they will be free from disease and otherwise. My name is Ikech Kumiraben. I am the president of the Environmental Health Club in Community Primary School, Ukwin. My duties as the president is calling out the people to wash the toilets and sweep the compound and wash your hands before going to the class and learn on Fridays. We call out all the people to sweep the com compound and make sure it is clean. And when they finish sweeping the compound, they pick out all the refuse in the ground and pack it somewhere and burn it. My name is Ali Chibike. I am the treasurer of the Environmental Health Club. As a member of EHC, we make sure that the school environment is clean always. We also teach people when to wash their hands and how to wash their hands, like after break, before eating, and after using the toilet. To complement the efforts of the government in ensuring that Nigeria achieves the target of becoming open defecation free ODF by 2025 and saving more than 100,000 children under five years of age from dying each year owing to diarrhea, Water Aid Nigeria through sanitation marketing Sanmark approach supports households to install the water easy toilets in their homes. My name is Sir Levi Idoko. I'm the wash coordinator of the Basin All Local Government. And uh, we've been partnering with uh, Water Aid in uh, water sanitation and hygiene projects since 2012. And ever since then, we've been working closely with Water Aid to see that the whole local government becomes ODF, open division free. Uh, we've also embarked on uh, school sanitation and hygiene with the introduction of environmental health club in schools, raising school people as uh, presidents, as executives of the environmental health club to see that school people are hygienic, they are personal, community or school hygiene are practiced. And in the sanitation marketing, that was when water easy toilet wet was introduced with the Satopan model. And since then, block molders, block producers were trained and the Kenechuku block industry became one of the, the pioneer producers of a, wet model of toilet and it has been selling. Okay, before the Sandmark and water aid, I'm a, a block industry man. We sell blocks, we sell balusta, we sell caps, even electric pools. We sell and install. I was trained by uh, Sandmark water aid in 2015. And since, that, since uh, 2015, I started uh, displaying selling wet toilet, sato, for everywhere. So I start from today now, I have already sell many as more than 6,000 households. And since then, I have having testimony. When I install from your house, people who come for that house, we ask of the person who installed it. That is how I just go. And some of the sales marketers, they help me for, the, for selling the sato pan. There is, any, there is any other, even, other states, I'm going there to install this toilet and also training more people to how to 
install the toilet. Because of the toilet is, too, is so affordable, it prevents uh, toilet infection and, all, and small water to flush it. It's more durable more than this ceramic because of water issues. So, and uh, because of this, it's affordable, affordable. It's very cheap because the cost is so low. So, so that all these poor people in the community are able to get it from my hand. So that is why they appreciate for that. I'm 75 years. We did the chapter. 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 We did the We the chapter. We did the chapter. We did the chapter. We did the chapter. I am myself, sir. I am the kitchen number 52 years. Toilet in Kembo, no, I need use a be here now. Then Kembo, I need use it, but it is going to be easy if you to know now. Man, go for your ego now. Go by it, you may want a toilet in Megan if you're and then coffee, I'm going to put in with a she daga daga and with a toilet. The stomach in a user in coffee, you hear ditch it, and I am marching. I did with anger in that. One woman, I wonder, mad, name with toilet in the yard, and then especially this new soccer pit. I am a wonder, mad, help with it, and you can see the Akoku Gota or Akoku Yada. On a company or drama, money more here no drama. No, with a toilet, the bear came and I went to my mother, my mother didn't need to see with a toilet. Based on our interaction with the traditional rulers council, they've promised to make their community bylaws on sanitation, uh, hoping that with that bylaw at community level, uh, every community will stop open defecation, every household will own and use a functional toilet in their places. The water easy toilets are very affordable, eliminate odor and flies, and require a very minimal quantity of water for flushing. These toilet models have been widely accepted by community members and have contributed significantly to the journey to an open defecation free state. As a citizen, do your part for us to achieve this goal.